Tennessee. I mean, <laughs> Gatlinburg, Tennessee. We are. We're here in Gatlinburg. It is Friday. We're going to take a walk through town. We're going to see what's new. Spring break is still going on. I'm just taking. <laughs> Gatlinburg on a Friday afternoon. Dawn, are you ready? ready. Let's do it. So it is Friday. It's still spring break. It is Friday. Spring break is still going on on a Friday afternoon. But spring break is winding down after this weekend. It should be a little more relaxed until the rod rod comes. We're supposed to be celebrating <laughs> spring fest right about now. But once we start walking down the parkway, yeah, we'll start building up, you know, some heat. Ripley's Aquarium of the Smokies is looking good. See those crazy Jabberjaw sharks. Hey, I'm gonna head into the buckboard too. So if you're in a pop culture, pop culture, they have pretty much everything in here. It's a really cool little, little store. Oh, it's old Spock and he's got, he's got his ears. Shake it y'all, shake it. That was cool, wasn't yeah. it? We got Peanuts Monopoly for Dawn. Got some Snoopy things here. Joe Cool. <laughs> Cheech and Chong. Cheez Its. I got some really crazy. Oh, there's Chucky. It's Chucky and his bride. Dawn's favorite subject killer clowns. I always got to stop at Buckboard, too. Lots of fun. Yeah, you got the Mountain Mall, Ripley's Mirror Maze. And there's nothing like taffy in Gatlinburg. Cousins, lemonade, beef jerky, chocolate monkey. Can we try that again? I'm sorry. Every few minutes, a new ogle dog is born. The best Bloody Marys in town. New York style pizzas and the calzones are crazy big. It's huge. It's absolutely huge. See that? You got chocolate moonshine, the chicken hut, koala fashion. I got the pick the last time we went out for lunch, and today Dawn has made a pick. We've been here before, but it's it's just that good. And uh, oh, it's gonna it's gonna be good. So mechanical bull rides are five dollars. Dawn and I are going to try a little bit of everything. It's it's quite big, and I think it's plenty for both of us. We're also going to get some street corn. Really, really cool. It feels like you're in Mexico or very colorful. There's the famous burro that you can ride for $5. It's got to be 18 years or older. And uh, I've never done it before. One of these nights, I'm going to come up here and give it a whirl. came out quick. And these two plates here are the sampler that we ordered and that is the street corn and that stuff is absolutely amazing take a look at that well we got a lot to share don't we sure jan yes look at that and this is a good deal for thirty dollars thirty dollars thirty dollars for a plate of nachos that have refried beans instead of meat and a frozen quesadilla that has been sliced into quarters i'm not so sure that's a good deal Remember, it didn't include the corn. Their bill will be nearly $50 for this. The sampler, and then you get the, the nachos and the street corn. I think we'll go ahead and get in that street corn first, right? Yeah. The way street corn should be. It's good stuff. Probably some of the best street corn you can find here in East Tennessee. That's good, huh? Yeah. Mm. I'm going to get a new tour. So is that queso? That's queso. White queso. This is 50% Mexican. A good little Mexican boy here is going to help us introduce to you our okay. brand new 20 year shelf life food. Oh, side. he's eating everything. Oh, he's eating. Oh, lovely. Yeah. Okay. I can't get so, it. I'm supposed to be introducing this right here. This is so many different kinds of food. This Paper is 20 right year shelf life food. And I put some of that yeah. cheese sauce on the on the taco. It is so That's called good. queso. 
That's Jesus off his cock cake, so. Oh, dear Jesus. That's off his oh, cock cake, so. I'm a gringo that's trying to tell you about so. Mexican so. food. Yeah. It's not going to work. No, that's Little Lord, cake, help so. me. You, uh, you, no. you got some Mexican blood. <laughs> Five of our kids are full-blooded Mexican wow, kids. So this is Mexican food that wow. real-life Mexicans approve of. I don't know about you, but there's nothing like queso mm, sauce. Tasty. I'll tell you that right now. Here's some fresh guacamole. And we still have this big... Take a look at that. Wow, that's... And the local burl is always good. A little pricey, but it's good. We always gotta stop off here at the original Smoky Mountain Taffy. Oh, uh, and the smell of taffy. There's, there's a little bit over there spinning around. Dawn, come down this alley with me. I wanna, I got something for you. Come over, oh, we, we gotta do it in the alley though. I got your fix. <laughs> can't be fixed. The merchandising a lot of these moonshine distilleries have up and down the strip. So they always have some interesting flavors here at Sugarlands. Maple bacon. At the Ego Brunch in a Jar Sipping Cream. Appalachian Sipping Cream. They got chocolate, coffee, birthday cake. Banana pudding, peanut butter, strawberries and cream. And they even have TV celebrities Mark and Diggers hazelnut. They just got the moonshine straight up. Sugar Lance was crazy. Definitely up to no good. Ripley's always has some interesting things. This creepy old Statue of Liberty is new. Yep. And it's quite busy here in Gatlinburg. Ober Mountain has a Jeep Gladiator. You could do everything with a Jeep Gladiator. You can bring the whole family, yeah. do a little camping out of the back back there. What color is there? Uh, it's kind of like a blue or something. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah. yeah. And it's different not seeing the rock shop anymore. In fact, there goes the aerial tram. Of course, it's 4 o'clock in the afternoon, so they closed. Howard's got a little bit of a facelift here. Got some new signs. Looks like they brighten up the front of it. But Gallenberg is looking good, ain't it? Yeah, yes. it's looking good. Yeah. Got a little bit of um, Okini Kitchen candy yeah. on it. Anakista's chairlift. So we're gonna go up there and see what's going on. Anakista, folks. Don, are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Probably should say, Will, are you ready, right? Well, are you ready? I am. <laughs> Let's do this, right? Let's do it. <laughs> Currently 38 degrees here in Gatlinburg, but there's no rain today, so that's that's a good thing. Good things are a signature of Martha Stewart living. They're those simple, clever shortcuts and solutions that make everyday living just a little easier. Send us a videotape of you with your favorite good thing and let us know how it's made your life just a little bit easier. And we are off. We're up to, <laughs> up to Anakista, everybody. But there is a, a new fake tree. Of course, you got uh, the Park Vista on top of the hill up there. Got beautiful panoramic views of the Great Smoky Mountains. It seems like every other time we come up here, we see bears. And I think the last time we were up here, though, I, I can't recall, but we, I think we might have seen a bear the last time we were up here. So maybe we're, maybe we won't see one. But then again, we could. <laughs> You're right over the top of the road. I know, I'm on the road. One tip we can give you about the chairlift is make sure you secure your car keys, your cell phone uh, in your pockets. Make sure they're zipped mm -hmm. up or, or what have you, because we had a friend who lost his cell phone <laughs> off of here yeah, that was years fun. ago. Uh, he's another uh, yell, uh, fellow YouTuber. Uh, yeah, I probably won't mention his name though, but um, there's a new store called Will's Workshop. He has his own store now here in Firefly Village. Yeah, 
so they're always improving up here. Of course, there's Ana Vista Tower off in the background. Let's head into the mercantile and see what's what's happening. Cowhide purses, uh, $122. I got some candles and look at these little mugs up here, little bears. Yeah, some snowmen yeah, over there. Yeah, Great Smoky Mountains National Park, uh, $21.99. So there has been some changes up here. Nothing crazy, but a few changes. <laughs> we gotta, of course we gotta do a Brit Dawn. Dawn, come on, what are you doing? She's always doing that to me. Ana Vista Tower was established in 2020. I can't believe that was over four years ago. Yeah, you can see Bluff Mountain over that way. And you can see Pigeon Forge off in the distance there. You can see the Pigeon Forge water tower off in the distance there. And there's Bluff Mountain, Sevierville down below it. A little bit of Pigeon Forge. And there's some glass panels up here you can walk. Beautiful, isn't it? <laughs> the last time we were here, Fur Trader wasn't open yet. And, and it's open now. Let's go in and check this new, this new mercantile out. Oh my goodness, the, they're moving. They're alive. The bears, the, the elk. I remember when you could hardly find any merchandise that said Anakista. Now they got lots. This place is really, really cool. I love the colors, that uh, chandelier up there. Something you can see Dolly in, you know? And we are on our way back down. Now, some folks were saying that they saw some bears coming up. It was a blast. Yeah. A little chilly today, but. Yeah. <laughs> folks, that's gonna do it for today. Here in Gatlinburg, Tennessee, hopefully you guys enjoyed Anakista. If you guys like this vlog, Give it. Also, if you haven't, please subscribe if you miss these upcoming Smoky Mountain Adventures. And until next time. Thanks for watching. Bye, everyone. <laughs>